So the decision to discontinue phototherapy is based on balancing the desire to minimize the exposure and separation of the mother and infant against the desire to avoid a rebound in the bilirubin. So obviously there is no necessity to keep the baby in hospital for checking for the rebound but where the risk of rebound is high you may prefer to keep them in for a day if the parents don't want readmission or you have to bring them earlier to the clinic. So rebound is defined as a bilirubin concentration reaching a phototherapy threshold for the infant age within 72 to 96 hours of discontinuing phototherapy. So phototherapy eliminates the bilirubin uh, that's present under the skin and so there will be redistribution after you stop the phototherapy and uh, there will be some rebound in all the babies but the significance of the rebound is what matters and the definition includes 72 to 96 hours obviously it precludes uh, keeping them in hospital for that long. Discontinuing phototherapy is an option when the bilirubin has reduced by at least 2 mg percent below the hour specific threshold at the time of initiation of phototherapy. So uh, this is a reasonable level to stop and uh, if you continue phototherapy for longer as well it's not harmful but it doesn't serve as much purpose because it's better to send the family home even for cost and insurance purposes. A longer period of phototherapy is an option if there are risk factors for rebound hyperbilirubinemia. As we will see next, it's mainly gestational age less than 38 weeks, age of the baby less than 48 hours at the start of phototherapy and presence of hemolytic disease. So if these factors are there, you would be either extending the stay waiting for the repeat bilirubin after 8 hours or so or bring them within a few hours.